each other at all. It's just well, it's a lot more competitive now. Yeah. People are struggling, man, and that's like people are just like, you know, grabbing hold of somebody and pushing them down so they can get a little bit more fucking headway. Um, because really, you have to, you know. I mean, I mean, but you know, I mean, you don't really have to. That's that's the thing. You really don't have to. I think I think it is best to really um, rely on on each other, the bands come together and and make like a community, um, and you know, just just make their own scene. And I see that happening with bands like Demolisha, Ashes Within, Alakin's Gun, and whatever bands that are happening right now, Ambient Death. All of these bands. They're, you know, it's like you need each other to, to make this fucking work. You really do. And, you know, we needed each other then, too, you know. All the bands that were happening then, man, like bands like Crisis and Candiria, Disassociate, 25 to Life. You know, we were all extremely different musically. Extremely different. But we were what made up a lot of, like, the New York scene that was happening then. You know, there was, there was like, a dozen or so bands that were constantly playing together, you know? Maybe less, maybe, like, a half a dozen or, you know, a little more than that, but we were always playing shows together. Yeah. You know, we were always... Um, I can think of a ton of bands that we were always on the bill with, like, Meat Jack, and, you know, and, like, fucking... Crisis was one of them. Candiria, Crisis, and Disassociate. We've played so many. We played so many shows together at CBS, but that was what kept people coming out. You know, those bands would play, and and kids knew, or young people knew that at that time that um, they were going to see their friends. And what the fuck, CBS man? You go out to CBS, you have a couple of beers, you check out the show, and you have a great time. And if you're in a band, or you have a zine, or you have a fucking whatever, and you're working on some of your own shit, then you fucking go out and you promote that shit, you know? And it was just like, like I said, man, there was a great scene then. And um, now I, you know, more than ever, I think that, that bands need that now.